few weeks to Christmas, Christian faithful are uncertain about their journey to the Holy Land as the National Christian Pilgrims Board has now suspended this year's pilgrimage. Uh, let's uh, talk to the Chairman, Board of Nigeria Christian Pilgrims Board, Reverend Yomi Kasali, for more updates on this development. Reverend Kasali, you have written a letter uh, which has now suspended all the pilgrimage exercises over financial scandal and flagrant disregard of processes. Help us understand what the content of this letter is and what it means for pilgrims who are interested in traveling. Thank you very much. Um, by the way, thank you for having me here today. Um, I hope your the audio is clear. I did as you clear. I did wrote, uh, wrote the letter uh, because our board met. We met sometime last month after we had a disastrous outing at Rome, and um, the people were not informed that we suspended pilgrimage activities until we meet again in December. And, and what, what happened and what caused that was the Rome disaster. It was a disaster. It was a disastrous outing. It was a sham, an embarrassment to the president and the office of the SGF. Of course, I had to put on record that a president <clears throat> has been of tremendous support to the Christian pilgrims in the last couple of years since I've been chairman. There's nothing we've requested from the president, and this is not a political statement. This is a statement of fact that is extensive the president of Federal Nigeria has not really obliged us. And I want to thank um, the SGF personally as well. Uh, Mr. Boss Mustafa is our supervising minister. He's been of tremendous support as well. They, they, both of them have been helping us. Uh, but we had operational challenges. The SGF was embarrassed. I can tell I can tell you that. You know, we took so many, so many Nigerians of high timber and caliber to Rome. Can you imagine without visas to um, to Israel, and then they were meant to be was meant to be a home Israel leg. Uh, we had an internal operational uh, quagmire and uh, anomaly, and so the board took responsibility. The board, I, I use this opportunity to once again apologize to all those that went the first class traditional rulers, the camp heads, the deputy governors, uh, the former camp president. We apologize to you uh, sincerely, most sincerely. It was an embarrassment to the nation. It was a national, it was a sham, it was, it was a ruse. It, that's a, what we call pilgrimage uh, operation. So we felt so bad, the board had a meeting. And when the board met, we agreed during the board meeting to postpone, to suspend or pretty commence with a flag off and we round up with uh, what we call reconciliation. We have put, put down reconciliation of our accounts. So we thought what we should do is to do things as we usually would do, which is to first and foremost close this operation and then begin the next one. The next one, by God's grace, is going to start in December. So we're not, we're not canceling pilgrimage activities for all um, good and well-meaning Nigerians who are eager to go for Christmas, uh, spend Christmas at the Holy Land. Please just hang in there for us. We're going to have a board meeting very soon. And we're going to determine the next place to flag off and how Reverend Kasali, we have a very short but time. Uh, uh, let me just butt in very quickly. December, when is the board December going to meet to yes. decide on this? And how soon can, yes. can pilgrims begin to uh, yes. hear about updates on the board's decision? In another two or three weeks, the board will meet again. Like I said earlier on, we cancelled it last month. We postponed it last month and suspended it till we meet again in December. We have sent out notices very soon. We are going to meet in another two or three weeks in December. And then we will submit a proposal to the SGF, who would approve it, I'm sure. He's very eager. He's been quite supportive. And so once we do that, we will then let Nigerians know when the next operations will start. I hope we'll still be able to go towards the end of this month, of uh, next month, December, and um, we'll run it through that December main pilgrimage. We'll run it most likely through till about April during the elections. We want to go and pray for Nigeria. We believe that this is the best time to go and spend time to pray for the peace of our land and that we have a wonderful free and fair elections come February uh, in 2023. Quickly, so quickly, going by God's grace. quickly, so Reverend, what's the, the cost of this tree? And, and, uh, 
Yes. Yes. What's the cost of this trip? Uh, I, I'm since gov government doesn't fully fund uh, this journey. We haven't again. decided. Um, that's we have not decided. That's that's. We have not decided. Usually, the board will sit to decide based on other uh, components. We have not decided. Like I said to you, the last it embarrassed us. The plane we inspected and approved was not the one given to us. In fact, some of us took cash. Can you imagine cash against international money laundering laws? They took cash to Rome. We could have been arrested and deported. So we, we, we thought that was quite bad. So we want to make sure we tidy all this out. The money and the fund has not been decided. The board will decide. Um, some people have said 1.5 million. No, that's not true. It will be way below that by God's grace. We understand the economic issues in the country. We will discuss with our ground handlers and our uh, uh, carriers. And we'll look at the group amount for one million Nigerians to go and spend them on Christmas and their holidays and to spend time to pray for the country and the Holy Land. And, and so we have not decided yet. That will be decided during the next board meeting. We'll definitely also follow up. Now with I want the, to reassure Nigerians through indeed. this wonderful medium to say, please. Indeed, Reverend Kasali. I'm afraid that's how much time can permit us to take. We'll also definitely follow up with the executive secretary to hear his side of this story. Uh, Reverend Yomi Kasali is the chairman board of Nigeria Christian Pilgrims Board. Thank you for talking to us on the news tonight.